I just wanted to do a quick video talking about how much I hate the Ryobi 18 volt OnePlus hand vacuum. So to start things off, the attachments are absolutely horrible. The crevice tool is extremely thick and has a massive opening at a very weird slanted angle. So it's very hard to pick anything up with it. This brush, brush head attachment here has a swivel mechanism on it. And anytime you try to vacuum anything up, the head will constantly spin and make it nearly impossible to pick anything up. This attachment here is about the best of the three and it's a piece of garbage. It can barely fit into any situation or scenario, especially if you're using a vacuum for the car. Now secondly, I want to talk about the power of the vacuum. The power is an absolute joke. There's essentially no suction power. There's less suction on this device than there is on my seven-year-old Kmart vacuum that I picked up for $30 and this thing was about $200. Uh, about $300 with the battery in Australia. So I'm going to quickly turn that on just to give you a little demonstration. So that's about the volume level, but the suction itself is pretty terrible. So we're going to come around here, and I'll be using the crevice tool for this. So I've just got a little patch of dirt here in the carpet. So as you can see, it picked up the finer little dust particles, but it can't pick up any hair. The, the little, uh, I don't know what you'd call this, quick release on the vacuum to empty it. A little button under here. This is absolutely terrible. So it does release the smaller items, but the grass and sticks and hair all get built up in, in the filter anyways. So you need to remove the entire compartment every time you want to empty the vacuum. Now the last thing I wanted to talk about is the size of the vacuum. It's actually quite large. It's quite hard to uh, quite hard to actually fit into most scenarios in a car. So the angles you have to come in at are quite awkward, and it makes it very hard to efficiently clean the car. And it's actually quite tiring on your arm muscles as well. I've found. Last but not least, the battery life. So I've got the 4 amp hour 18 volt lithium battery here and I've been using it for about 5 minutes, 10 minutes and we're already down one bar so one of these 4 volt, uh, 4 amp hour rather batteries is going to last you about 20 to 25 minutes maximum so yeah that's my little review I definitely wouldn't recommend this to anyone I'd recommend putting your money into something like a Dyson maybe, a handheld Dyson vacuum or maybe just a, a wired vacuum.